conversation about science and scientists. Telling stories from scientists' lives and draw of science could last for hours. Stories of different kind, funny and tragic. There is only one wealth which is knowledge and only one evil which is ignorance. This is a quotation from great Greek philosopher Socrates. He said 24 centuries ago, and a short while after, in quite a democratic way, by a majority vote, he was sentenced to death and drank a cup of with suitor. We'd find another hundred of quotations about benefit of knowledge and scientists, but all of them will not change the present situation in Russian science, which is undergoing hard days. Let's use another quotation from the Bible, which says that there is no prophet in your own country. Scientists often turn up to be prophets, as they show the future in this or that sphere of life. And here's an example. Today we often speak about first ecological disasters, calling them catastrophes. Meanwhile, we can say that so far humanity has faced a real catastrophe for the first time. Death or molecular of a compound called methyl tetrabutyl eth MTBE is rapidly spreading in our natural reservoirs, storing invaluable drinking water. MTBE, a highly strong concentrate, is added to gasoline. Part of it doesn't bust and with rainwater penetrates groundwater. The dangerous molecular was found in drinking water in the United States in 1996. Science centers on both coasts have tried to find a way to cleanse the water, but with no success. Today, 1,968 municipal tree plants closed down in 36 states. Despite all costs, the liquidation of the catastrophe will take at least four years and will cost $800 billion. Russian scientist Viktor Patrick, who lives in Lang region, Russia, has solved the problem. It's not the first time that our program speaks about his colossal intelligence, unique science inventions. Foreign mass media calls him St. Petersburg genius, and considering his worldwide science reputation, it was to him that American President George Bush referred for help. In six months' time, the scientists not only developed a method of complete water purification from TBE, but also built a machine able to work in offline mode for dozens of years. And here I am holding the document proving this fantastic result. Fantastic but true. The 21st century is now shown to us, people of the third millennium, that the triumph of technical progress is growing more and more, like a fist during an epidemic of bubonic plague. Ecological catastrophes stopped being something occurring only in science fiction stories. Environmental disasters have acquired the status of many countries' national problems, and make MPs, senators and congressmen hair go grey. It's coming June, Bush the Elder will be celebrating his birthday with his family and friends, as well as with some privileged politicians. One of the few special guests invited to this party is our countryman, Professor Viktor Ivanovich Petrik. Uh... President Bush, our 41st president, will be having his birthday party on the 12th and 13th of June. It's an honor for us to invite Professor Petrik to be Mr. President's guest. This is a manifestation of attitude to the scientists whose wonderful invention allowed the United States to solve a grave ecological problem. A group of American scientists paid me a visit eight months ago. I was given a certain task to turn an MTBE. Frankly speaking, I didn't work on it for about two months, because I didn't realize how important and how serious the problem was. Then I learned about the Santa Monica disaster, and about the six wells that got closed by the Court of Justice. Morgan Corporation paid one and eight hundred million dollars of forfeit for dealing with the consequences of the disaster. This was a very suasive example, and I started working. Now the machine is ready. Actually, this MTB is not an exclusively American problem. The particular gasoline component has been introduced recently, but it causes serious environmental problems. It gets absorbed into the soil together with rainwater. Its molecules are so tiny that they penetrate extremely deep into groundwater. This compound is a powerful concentrate. It's very dangerous indeed. American Accords arrived in St. Petersburg to test the capacity of Victor Patrick's unique machine.
Я Томас Лейхи, работаю в аналитическом центре, аккредитованном при правительстве США. В этой машине применено... This machine was used of several technologies introduced by Professor Patrick. He is the person who invented a way to with MTB. This compound was first used to reduce industrial pollution of air. However, it polluted the water, and we didn't have a technology to solve this problem. The problem of MTB was first spoken of in 1996. World's best scientists were helplessly shrugging their shoulders. Now this war has five times higher concentration of MTB than the water of Santa Monica, 250 parts per billion. Next week we will take this machine to the United States for demonstration. Now we are going to run this polluted through Prophet Patrick's machine. The set for drinking water is five parts per billion. The standard itself is a manifestation of despair, for there can be no standard concentration of MTB, just as there can be no standard concentration of potassium cyanide. In their application to Professor Patrick, American Cox wrote, We pray God that he will manage to reduce concentration of MTB to at least 30 parts per billion. Even that will be a fantastic result. The California laboratory experts made their own tests of the results. It was found out that after the passage through pet machine, the MTB polluted water was absolutely clean. This water has come through Professor Pet's machine. You can drink it, it's pure water. This water is I made this machine two months ago. I placed concentrates containing a group of platinum here. And I generate a gas that combined only elements from the platinum group. At a certain temperature, only pure metals start accumulating here. Here are palladium, platinum, and osmium. Using this gas phase technology, I create special systems that enable us to cleanse the water that passes through this machine of whatever contaminants it contains. This is how this technology works. Victor Patrick's discovery is a blend for the whole human race. And what concerns to boost the elf, Victor Patrick as a true rat is not going to go to a party without a present. I initiated a new trend in art. It will be called Treacher on Precious Stones. I asked Mr. The Junior to send me a picture of his father and sent me around 30 photos. These are all from the state. This is how he is going to be represented, with an American eagle in the background. I think I did a good job. For even before you recognize him to be Mr. Bush, you see he is an American. This is my greatest sculptural achievement. We hope that the cooperation with Professor Patrick will create a... We hope that the technology developed by Professor Patrick will be very beneficial for our country, both in environmental issues and for the country's economy. What is especially precious, Professor Patrick neither adapts nor transforms the methods discovered before him, but invents completely new technologies. And it's not, not the reproduction of uh, existing technology, but the innovation and the unique thinking and uh, inventorship of Professor Petrick that will solve the problems that we have before us in the 21st century. Thank you. It seems fantastic, but it's true.